Hey, hey, what's good, guys? It's your boy Dizo, and today we got two unboxings, but we're basically just gonna be doing one unboxing today because I have the white, black, gym red. Let's just take a peek on what this shoe looked like. But today, we're just only gonna be doing this shoe right here. Box tag reads, Air Jordan 1 Low, white, white gum yellow, blank, John Gum, I don't know how to pronounce that, blank. Size eight, just at retail price, is 90 bucks. The reason why I don't wanna discuss about the other shoe is because I'm waiting on a different size to compare it with so let's take a look at this one I posted a picture of these last week exactly seven days ago and I missed out on these and that's why I bought the all beige colorway BAM all right, talking about the shoes, we got pink bottoms. Look at that pink bottom right there. Sexy, sexy. Midsole, this is gum midsole. Gum colored midsole right there. And the upper, to me, looks like flesh. Close to a salmon, salmon, whatever you want to pronounce it. Or however you want to pronounce that. Jordan tag right there. And all suede on the upper except the tongue. Similar to how the University Gold was made. And this is my impulse buy because when this released, I missed out on these. Pretty simple shoe. Um, I think I've said in one of my videos that I will be trying to get ones. I did not expect myself to get lows. So inside is actually black lining with a pink jump man right there. But yeah, I did not expect to start loving lows because I did own a low before and I gave it to one of my friends back in Cebu. And when I tried the University Gold in store, I ended up liking the fit. So that's why I started to collect, not collect, but buy Jordan 1 lows. Not to say I don't like the high OGs or the mids. It's just a matter of preference. Uh, this is what I've been discussing with a friend of mine yesterday about letting hype or other people's opinion dictate what he wants. I'm like, that's not the way to go, bro. Because at the end of the day, the only person you're trying to please is yourself and what you want. And buying shoes, that's dealing with your own money. So my best advice to sneakerheads, may you be a sneakerhead then or a sneakerhead now. It's your money, man. Whatever, whatever shoe you buy, that's your money. It's not other people's money. So you are not obliged to make other people happy but yourself that's all i can say about that i wish on this pair it would have had like a all suede like the women's pair right here but they don't so it is what it is i'm still happy with the purchase what do you guys think comment down below the shoe hot or not thank you guys for watching thank you guys for your support and yes, I am hurt again, but it, it's whatever. It's just time, man. It just takes time. Thank you guys for watching again, and I will see you guys soon, man. Peace.